what's up my beautiful soul subscribers how y'all doing it's your girl of known goddess tarot all right now yesterday welcome first of all to my beautiful soul subscribers i'm not gonna jump into that energy uh um if this is your first time joining welcome i welcome you with love and light baby i welcome you with love and light Ooh, I got up with some fire in me today, my collective. Yesterday's reading got me reminiscing over it today. Like, really? And I'm going to tell y'all the truth. It was an hour and 20 minutes. One, two, zero. Like I said, y'all in y'all powerful manifestation. Y'all out here on the truth. You living in that high priestess energy. You out here balanced, baby. Yeah. Shit is coming your way. You taking that leap of faith, that risk, you know what I'm saying? You free spirit of year. And that karma baby mama, baby daddy didn't, don't like that shit pulling the black magic. Uh, that reading was very long. Damn. But I'm going to tell you all the truth. That energy was for that person. And I know I sound like a broken record in that video. It's like an uh, hour and 20 minutes just to say the same shit over. But it wasn't shit, my collective. Seriously. Yo, when I, when I wanted to stop spirit was like, keep talking because there's somebody that's being stubborn and still not seeing this baby mama or baby daddy for who they are. And they need to hear it. Keep repeating it. You know, like you're talking to a child and you, they, you know, when you were a kid or a teenager, your parent just sound annoying to you because they kept saying the same shit. You be in the room to yourself, repeating it and making your face like, yeah, 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 yeah. I felt like that's how I was yesterday, but Spirit wanted me to be that. Y'all seen the, the gratitude, the guidance, you know, the warning, but that's not what that's about today. It's just still so, res it's still residual. Yeah, you know, this Lion Gate portal really is like illuminating a lot of shit. And I told you these, these karmics was just gonna try to go extra hard with that energy. If you weren't on your game, and somebody, that one particular person still wasn't on their game about that parenting, that toxic family. But like I said, that's not what it's about today. I am going to push out the last, but definitely not the least, baby, is the Lion Gate portal for my fire signs. Sag, Leo, and Aries, okay? Um, yeah, I'm doing it how Spirit wants me to do it, right? It's not about getting ahead of the time or before the time as long as it's, it's within the time of what spirit says it is right so this today is what they are plotting uh, or what they yeah because they still working they ain't never gonna stop lying gate or not they're gonna still keep trying but this energy right here is just very powerful and anything that you manifest in this energy and anything dark that you try to manifest for those karmics it's gonna fire back so freaking quick so quick it's gonna be an instant boomerang all right yeah so gotta be careful of your thoughts out here too my collective right yeah that energy is real baby this this is real life out here this ain't no joke but i welcome y'all with love and light damn i've been on that for three minutes and two 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 twenty one seconds yeah somebody needs to hear that all right so let's get this reading open today mother isis father god thank you for your spiritual guidance as i open these realms to my beautiful soul subscribers this reading is for my fire signs aries leo and sag uh what is it they're plotting for the lion gate portal 88 baby and beyond yeah wow what is it they're plotting mm. ain't gonna be good for them it ain't gonna be good for them. We gonna shuffle it out. As I open these realms, protect my auras and my chakras. Mother Isis, Father God, yeah. Give me clear, honest messages. Use me as a vessel. So more to be. So more to be. Yeah, it ain't gonna be a good look for them. Look at that. Hmm? Whatever they doing, they gonna be held back. They gonna be stuck in their life. They're not gonna be able to manifest any change in their life. Because whatever they out here planning in the dark for you, my fire signs, uh-huh, uh-huh, 
whatever they planning for you out here in the dark ain't nothing good but it ain't gonna be nothing good for them either okay i'm sorry y'all that's my one of my neighbors outside she sounds like she's she sounds like she's um actually here under my window but she's in the parking lot but never mind that <laughs> all right so yeah whatever they planning out here showing sure ain't, ain't gonna manifest in their favor well no it ain't they're gonna be stuck with that karma. They're gonna step, they gonna be stuck with them, that entity. Whatever they're trying to dig up in the night, they're gonna be stuck with that entity. Okay, now they ain't gonna be able to get rid of this demon. <laughs> okay, they ain't gonna be able to get rid of this demon, my fire signs. They're going to be, this attachment, whatever they pulling out here, I'm going to tell you the truth, they're going to be stuck because they're doing something in the dark out here. Deep, you see this deep blue? Huh? I take this, I take this color in my, in my, in my, in my um, Uno deck as uh, the crown chakra, the third eye. I take it as swords, energy. Yeah, I do. Uh-huh. Some type of, yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh. I take it as spiritually deep or knowing when it's in the upright. This is someone who's going through their transformation. That's what I would take it as in, that, in other words. But, oh, not them. They're going to be unable to manifest changes in their life. I promise you. Spirit is going to break them down to nothing. So let's see what they're coming up with. What they what they plot. Because whatever they're working, we obviously see it ain't going to work. There it goes. It's called that whatever they're sending your way. Huh? It's going right back on their ass. Look at that spirit. What, 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 what did I say? What did I say? Huh? What does first say, collective? My fire signs. My fire signs. My fire signs. What did I just say? What does first say? Whatever they're doing, it will not manifest onto you. It will be reversed and sent back and they will be stuck where they're at. They will be staying in this stalemate energy. That reverse is in reverse. Okay? All right, now. That's to me, that's like the six of swords in reverse. Okay, they're going to be stuck with their mental issues. Yeah, they are. If they're manifesting some clouded judgment on you, this is what's going to happen for them, baby. All right? All their manifestations, everything that they got, 10. That's a 10 in reverse. They will never be able to let go of that entity that they're trying to plot and plan on you. They will never be able to come from under their own clouded judgment that they're trying to prepare for you. They will never be able to take a new brand new leap of faith out here with uh, on their own lives fucking with you. No. No. That's not true. That's not that will never happen. So they could go ahead and take their calculated risks. Go ahead. They could go ahead and take that risk, but they're going to be sorry. They're going to be sorry. All right, my collective. Let's see what this is all about. Yeah. That magician spell work ain't going to work. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. No, it ain't. They're going to look like a fool. They're going to look like a fool. All right, now let's see what's good, sir. Give me, give me, let me clear on his messages on this. Use me as a vessel. But they going to look like, look at them. Look at them. Is this somebody that's jealous, envious, bitter? Like to have the upper hand? Very controlling? We're going to shuffle their ass out, though. We're going to shuffle them out, my collective. My fire signs. Hmm. <laughs> Spirit going to break them down in illness. Spirit is going to break this person down in illness. Mental illness, physical illness. Yeah. 
They're going to want to rest and heal and put their situations to rest, but they will never be able to manifest any change. I'm going to tell you right now, whatever they're plotting and planning out here because of their jealousy, because of their envy, because of their bitter heart. You hear me? Whatever they are plotting out here, spirit is about to break them down in that physical. Their physical stability, that root chakra. You see this red? This root chakra. Because whatever they are manifesting on you, spirit is letting them know they can't fuck with you. You're on, you're free spirited. You tap into your own new beginnings. You could tap into that spirit. Yeah, you are. You fully aware. You fully aware. You see them, you see that new beginning? Your spirit is free from those bound from bound from bound from um bondages. You ain't stuck out here. You know how to manifest and re and some of y'all know how to do y'all own energy work and reverse shit. Send it back. You are the magician. But see, they don't know that. They don't know that. They don't know they fucking with a chosen one. Nah. They don't know that. Wow. But spirit is giving them a warning. They gonna get ill. They gonna get ill for acting like this. Spirit gonna put them to rest. Hmm. That's that Ace of Wands in reverse. That's that health in reverse where they won't even have their own independence. They can't help themselves in this situation. Yeah. That one, number one, new beginning. No, 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 no. They're going down the wrong path. They definitely with that Two of Wands in reverse. They're going down the wrong path. Absolutely going down the wrong path. Let's get a proper shuffle, my soul subscribers. Please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification button. That is your way of donating to the channel and getting the messages out to who needs to really hear it, my collective. Because this ain't no joke. This is real life out here, okay? This ain't flipping cars and just like it's some soap opera. This is real life energy. You see this shit all the time on TV, discovery, crime, and all that, but we ain't projecting that out here. That's why you're here listening. That's why put Spurs put us here to give you guys the messages to get you from under this clouded judgment. All right? To see the truth. That's what we're here to help y'all take y'all leap of faith. Free your spirit. That's what we're here to do. That's why we're put here. This ain't a joke. This ain't just to come up here and laugh at the karmic. Look at that. Look at you. Didn't I tell you that's you right here? Free spirited. You on your destiny. Wheel of fortune, baby. Turning point, right? Yeah, baby. Destiny. This is also karma. Life cycle. Whatever they're doing will be projected right back onto them. Because they out here trying to pull some mag magician stunt. But spirit is like, whatever they trying to plot and plan on you, it ain't going to work. Look at you, beautiful, standing on your own, baby, will of fortune, and they don't get it. So whatever, it's like the more they try to do to you, the more you stand in your power. It's like they push you towards your destiny even further. Look at you, didn't I tell you? The more they push you towards your, towards your, to your destiny even further. This queen of pentacles is an earth angel, baby. Okay. You're on your destined path, okay? So you are a single, hard-working parent as well, because that's what the Queen of Pentacles mean as well in the end the um, Ride of Terror. Single, hard-working parent. You definitely out here achieving your material wealth, okay? And you out here giving messages, healing messages. That's the here go the star card, baby. There it is. Okay, and this is somebody who you you who who you who who wounded you. And because you set up them healthy boundaries, okay, yeah. Yeah, you released yourself from those attachments. You decided to rest and step out, all right? Because you know you needed to heal from the situation. And that's what you did. You turned your back up, okay? You decided to make a move. And what you did when you made that move, right here, right here. This is what you did. When, when they decide to turn their back on you, decide they didn't want to take no more actions with you, Okay, there were a distraction in your life. That Ace of Wands is in reverse, baby. There was absolutely a distraction in your life. Okay, lack of their own direction, right? Mm hmm So they turned their back, thought they was going to get better. But yeah, they left you in this wounded warrior state, right? But you bossed up. You bossed up. 
They left you without, they left you as a single parent, but that's all right because they, I'm going to tell you right now, this person Kate, was only in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson in order for you to get up in your path right here on your destined path, baby, to end that karmic cycle. And that's what's killing them because they never thought that you would get on your star power. They never thought that you would heal and get a renewal. They never thought that you would find your purpose in life. No. They never thought that you would take that leap of faith. They never thought that you would be fearless. They never thought that you would make a plan and make a decision on your own and figure your own shit out here. Now you stable materialistically, mentally, financially, in every single way. Look at that. Beautiful, baby. And that's what they envy you for. This is what the envy is for. All because you took a brand new beginning and leap of faith and you're in that hermit energy too. You ain't thinking about them. I ain't sorry. I ain't sorry. Ninja, nah. Looking at my, you should have been home. Today I regret that night I put that ring on. You always got them fucking excuses. I pray the Lord he revealed what your truth is. I left a note in the hallway. By the time you read it, be far away. Far away. And I ain't gonna fuck with nobody, right? Why? Because I gotta take care of me and my babies. Me and my babies, we gonna be all right. And that's where you at right now, my fire signs. Whether you're a single father or you're a single mother, you doing it, boo. You bossed up, boo. On your spiritual gift, you awaken, boo. You know your life purpose right here. You on your life path right here. You deep in your spirituality and you physically, like I said, you just, you, you gifted. Since you left, they thought they was gonna get better. Look what they ended up with. Unable to manifest any fucking change in their life now. They feel like a fucking fool. When they left you right here, turned they back on you. Uh-huh, thought they was gonna get better. Look what they ran into. Huh? Now they stuck. They thought they had other options. Didn't I tell you when they left and took a leap of faith out here? What did they run into? End up being left out in the fucking cold. <laughs> When they thought they had other options out here, turned their back on you and left you out, look what they end up doing. They end up end up leaving their fucking self out. Now they going through money loss. Whoever they jumped out here with, somebody attached to them, look at them. They struggling with that option. Yeah. They struggling with that option. Yeah, they are. Didn't I tell you they feel like a fucking fool? They stuck right here now. Lack of direction for them now. While wow, you done turned your back and made a difference in your life, huh? Look at that. How beautiful. How the tables have turned. Shit. Yeah. Okay, the tables have turned now. Mm-hmm. Tables have turned. Wow. Woo! Wow. Wow, they thought they was going to get better. You healed. Now they right here. Now they right here. <laughs> wow, I'm so wow. This is crazy. This is crazy. And if this haven't come yet, they better get ready. Because this is what's coming. Because they plotting for you. This is what's coming. Cause the more they, they the more they go against you, my collective, the more you heal. They don't already know you on your game. Can't they see you already got your you on your destined path out here? Didn't I tell you already took that leap of faith, baby? You out here freeless. You free spirited out here. This is what they thought they were doing in the past. Uh uh, boo. Didn't I tell you? They thought they was getting their opportunities out here and taking new beginnings. No boo. That was a clouded judgment. Now they out here, lack of direction. Don't know where the fuck to turn. Left out in the cold, feeling like a wounded warrior. Because they made the wrong choice. They made the wrong choice. They made the wrong choice. 
whoever they were, very stubborn. This emperor energy, very stubborn. Uh-huh, they ain't master shit out here. Nope. Nope. This is someone who's lacking of oh, if who lacking their own control to have no self-control out here. Right here. Right here with these sevens. No, no self-control. They dash out the Panani. They dash out the buddy. Yeah, anything that looks good and option. Well, yeah, they choose their option. They don't give a fuck. Well, now they give a fuck. Now they do. Now they do. Because why? Right here. They suffering. Now they're in isolation, stressing, money loss. Yeah, go sit down. Them and they options. Go sit down. Wow. So let's see what's going on by fire signs, because I don't know, I don't know. Whatever they trying to do, baby, you healed. You got your spirit guides all around you. Yeah, they pissed off. They hurt. They're in a struggling relationship out here. Yeah, that option that they chose. Yeah, that option got them under clouded judgment. Because that's what's going to be reversed onto them. That's what they was projecting onto you. So that's what they got back. That's what they got back. Your back is turned, boo. Okay, you out here continuing making future plans for you and your little ones if you're a single parent. Or just yourselves in, 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 in general, overall. You just out here stable, looking good, smelling good. You're an earth angel, baby, and they took you for granted, and that was the worst thing they ever did. They sorry they did that shit. They paying for it now. They paying for it now. And Spirit is just like, you know what? Keep your back turned. That's what I'm getting right here. Uh-uh, keep your back turned. You already went through this. All right, they, 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 they let them go through their own fucking judgment out here. Let they stay with their shit. Uh-uh, don't go back, okay? You already released this. You already set them boundaries. Mm -mm. Now they need to go within and heal. This is them right now, feeling like a fucking wounded warrior. Yeah. Now they right here with their lack, lack of direction. Some of them was pulling spell work on you to keep you stuck, whoever these people are. Whoever they are. I, I strongly feel a lover, a friend, whoever they are. Doesn't matter. Stay right here, baby. Keep nurturing yourself, honey. Didn't I say? Keep your back turned. All right. Keep keep them future plans going, honey. Follow your insights out here, honey. Keep it pushing. Keep it pushing. Cause they gonna go. They gonna want to try to come back and apologize because they broke and they distraught and they out. They left out in the cold. Okay. Their other options didn't work out for them, obviously, as we can see. Okay. Their other options did not work out for them. Don't let them come back out here and take you all in because they only coming back with distractions. Don't let them come back. Let them let them hold their judgment. Let they hold their judgment. I don't care who it is. I don't care if it's Rufus the dog. He should have been loyal. He should have been loyal. He should have been loyal when he thought he was turning his back on out, out here, out you, making his future, future decisions. Well, guess what? Oh, uh, excuse me. You really bossed up. Okay, you really, really bossed up, not only just financially, but spiritually. Okay, this person was only in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson, my, my, uh, my collective. All right, now, so whatever they're planning and plotting, honey, stay right here and nurturing yourself, honey, stay right here on your mature vibes. Uh huh, uh huh, your compassionate self and being kind to others is you to that mommy daddy figure. Okay. Whoever you are, mom, dad, keep doing it. Keep loving yourself, boo. All right? Yeah. You on your spiritual path, boo. You use, some of y'all are using this spiritual gift to bring forth your stability. Helping others to heal. Okay? Helping others to, you know, look out in the foresight and heal their past wounds. That's what some of y'all do for a living. You're using your spiritual gift, honey. Yes. You're happy. Happy home. Happy life. And this is why it's a fucking burden to them. Yeah. Because they want to come back here and see you on your grind. Because they see you on your grind. You out here stable, my collective. You out here with your wheel of fortune, success, prosperity, destiny. And that was always your destiny. But this person was always blocking you in the past. 
because they didn't have a sense of direction on their own. They thought sex was the answer. They thought if they gave you a little, uh, 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 that's all you should settle for, and that's it. Who the fuck they was playing with? Who they who they were playing with? You? I think not. So right now they fucking stress and they need help. They need help. But don't let them come back right here. They're gonna take you off. They they only coming back with distractions. Okay. Don't let them don't let them come back with that fake apology and talk about no false hopes. And I really highly doubt that, my collective. Look at you. Like I said, you bossed up. You bossed up. Me and my babies, we gonna be all right. They can say they can only sit right here in this nostalgic energy and think about it. That's the only thing they're gonna have to do. That's the only thing they're gonna have to do because they can't come back. That cycle is over. That cycle is over, baby. You've been enlightened. You're illuminated. Like I said, you're using them spiritual gifts, baby. Real talk out here, baby. And you're protected. And some of y'all, like I said, you know how to send that shit back. Don't get it twisted now. They don't, they don't want to fuck with the wrong one now. They better know what they're doing because they're causing their own demise out here. They really are. You can see it right here. Lack of direction. Look at them. Stress. That's that 10. Wherever they are, they want to take a leap of faith, but they can't. They feel like a fucking fool because they was acting reckless out here. They were acting reckless. But guess what? Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. <laughs> Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. You gone. You left. You said bye, fool. My future's looking bright. Come back where? Never. Come back to what? Ne what this? Never. Okay. Never. I done. I did too. I done heal myself. I done got woke woke. Mm mm. I done got woke woke. I did my. I got off that. I, I got off that karmic wheel. I, 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 I ended that karmic cycle. Turning point. Psh, keep it pushing. Oh. I got future plans out here, baby. I got the foresight is on. It's on point out here. That foresight is on point out here, okay? I got too many ships out here. There's too many seeds that I done planted and wait for it to come in. I ain't got time for you. Who got time for you? Better go on and make your own moves out here. Cause I already done bossed up and doing it for me and the babies. Did it one and I'm doing it well. I'm loving me. I healed all my pasthood, childhood wounds, traumas. Uh-uh, I had to let go of all of that because you was adding to it. Because you was, ref I was accepting what I was, was being projected onto me. Not no more. Not no more. I ain't gonna let you come out here and steal our children's innocence and keep them in the bullshit and the turmoil. Uh-uh. No, no, no. If I don't get it right, how the fuck is the babies gonna get it right? Somebody gotta be a better parent out here for some of y'all who is parents with this person. Somebody got to make a better move out here. And so you did. And you're a, you're a wonderful example to those children. Perfect example. I commend you. Straight up. I love it. So now they right here left out in the cold. They're going through a fucking struggling relationship with this karmic. Because they ended up with a karmic. Yeah, they did. Some of them, they just ending up, they holding their judgment out here. Yeah, because they pulling magic out of you, on you. I'm going to tell you that right now. They trying to pull spell work on you out here. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Oh. oh now they want to see what's this. They earth angel. They earth angel. Now they want to see you as this. How regretful. The spirit is granting you someone new. The so fire signs, yeah. And if this person is leaving a situation, if this emperor or this empress left this situation,
because they realize that they got love for you, Queen of Cups. Somebody's nostalgic over you. I know this is what they are. This is the karmic, but I'm picking up another energy too. Wow, I'm feeling like wow, I'm getting double double here. Okay, this is this is heavy. This 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 portal. I never engaged in a uh, a reading a, a Lion Gate portal in my collective because I, I I was just getting on my journey last year. I've seen it a lot with the tarot readers, but now that I'm more awakened to the journey and what it means and how it works, I'm getting like so much energy. So somebody, you're an emperor or an empress. All right, this is it again. Let me, let me, let me not go in this hour, two hour reading again. All right, for some of y'all, it could be anybody. It could be a friend. It could be family members. But I really strongly feel more of a lover or someone who you consider to be a really close friend to you. Okay? For some of y'all, it's an ex-husband. Yeah? For some of y'all, it's an ex-husband, ex-wife. All right? All right? Yeah. Yeah. And they're trying to stop your new beginnings. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they're trying to create clouded judgment out here. They're still trying to cause confusion for you out here, right? But spirit is like, that won't happen. You took that leap of faith, here it is, baby. They feel stupid for taking that leap of faith because they thought they had other options, okay? Yeah, they did. But it's a clouded judgment on their ass, okay? But with the Six of Cups energy, this is not only you, my collective, healing yourself. Um, you had to look towards the past in order to go forward in the future, right? You had to. You had to go back. You had to go way back to it. So you did that for yourself and you did that. But also I'm picking up another energy on the Six of Cups energy. Someone from your past. And I really am picking up on an Emperor Empress energy. Um... Who is no longer <sighs> my gosh i don't want to sit here forever y'all let go this person thought they had other options whoever this ex-lover is baby daddy ex-husband whoever this is almost a similar same situation from yesterday all right but you on your path, you transform. They thought they had other options. Boom, bomb. That didn't work out for them. Obviously, this is them right now. Okay? This is them. This is the one that took that leap of faith. Okay? They ended up, when they turned their back on you, mm -hmm, this right here, thought they was making future decisions, future plans. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. They, they, they made a clouded judgment out here. Now they fucking hurt. They stressed. They left out in the cold. They chose another lover over you. Yeah, because they thought they had other options. Yes. Yes. So they feel like a fucking fool now, right? Yeah. All right. Some of them, okay. Some of them could be pulling this illusion work. It could, it could be that one. But I'm also feeling somebody else from the past, my collective, who's in this nostalgic energy. This is coming out again. They let go of someone who they knew it was time to let go of. They let go of their own burdens as well. This could be your twin. They also took that leap of faith. You see the two? Yeah, okay. They also left that situation. Yeah, they finally decided to make up their mind because they knew they had to leave. Okay, yeah, they, 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 had, they knew they had to make a decision. I feel like they was just really being burdened, you know, in a home. This emperor, this emperor energy, this Aries energy. I feel like this emperor decided no more. Uh, I'm tired of being a broken heart. That three of wands, that three of swords is in reverse. Okay. I'm not going to sit here because maybe we planted so many seeds, you know, and all that I built, you know, I'm trying to be patient with you, but they, whoever they with, they feeling like a fucking wounded warrior out of here. This person keeps testing their faith. And they're tired of being patient. 
So they let go of their situation too. They left their karmic out in the cold. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. That karmic had your person under these confusions, clouded judgment. Yes, they did. Had them under these burdens. Yes, they did. Yeah. This is two different scenarios. Yes, it is. It's two, dis two different scenarios, my fire signs. Yes, they did. So you both took that leap of faith. But I feel like your person, they are also wounded. Your true soulmate. This one right here. This one. That's who, who decided no more. I'm tired of being left out in the cold with you. I'm tired of struggling with you emotionally, financially. I'm tired of isolating my feelings when I really feel stressed with you. I want a new beginning. I just want a new beginning. And they took a leap of faith. Yes, they did. They're in a hermit energy right now because they, they right now they know that they need to heal. Okay, they release themselves from that attachment and they out there. Yeah, it's time for rest. They decided to make up their mind and it was time to rest and put up those healthy boundaries. They got themselves from under this two of swords, this person who they're with, this karmic right here, this six of swords energy in reverse. Yes, yeah, somebody who's unable to manifest their own new beginnings. This is a past life karmic soulmate. I'm telling you, I know what I'm feeling with the cards right here. Yes. I know what I'm feeling with this card right here. Okay, this person only wanted them for stability. This Queen of Pentacles, oh my God, this is happening again, Spirit. Please give me strength to give this reading. Okay, they know this person only wanted them for stability. Queen of Pentacles, oh my God, I'm picking up both energies, guys. So bear with me, okay? Three, three, eleven on the clock. I'm picking up both past life energies, karmic soulmate that they need. They ending the cycle with, and the and the new beginnings. This Two of Wands right here, thirty three eleven. Okay, this new this Two of Wands. Your person knew as well that they had to let go because they got tired. Mm -mm, they got tired of this karmic testing the waters with them. They tired of being patient with them. So they made up their mind to let go of these burdens. I feel like it's a if it's it's two different time zones though. It's two different time and energies out here. That's, that's what I'm picking up. It's just, you are ahead of yourself already, my Queen of Pentacles. That Queen of Pentacles is just a single parent. You know, somebody who's stable. You know, somebody who is just very much stable. A, a working parent, achieving your goals. You're already out here. You're sharing your wealth, your gifts, your spiritual gifts. And you are the one that they are watching. Oh my God, Spirit, give me the truth. Okay, I feel like you're giving this your person inspiration to leave. This is the same thing. You're giving you're giving your person inspiration to leave. So this karmic out here knows this. This karmic knows where your person is taking the leap of faith to come to. Your person left that karmic out in the cold. Yeah, they let go. They let go of that stability. They, they, they gained the independence out here. They let go. They're on their own. They left that karmic to be on their own. No more. No more. I'm not going to sit in this three of swords no more. I'm tired of feeling like a wounded warrior. No more. I'm turning my back on that shit and letting go of these burdens. That's what your person did because they are, they, they, they in love with you. Okay. Oh my gosh. They are in love with you. This person is tired of daydreaming over you. I'm picking up different energies on these cards. Bear with me, my collective. Please do. Please do. Okay. They're tired. They're tired of having, yeah, they want real love. They, 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 they're tired of ignoring their feelings. Okay. But this baby mama over here, or whoever this person that your person leaving. Oh, spirit, give me energy. Give me the strength. Give me clarity, spirit. You're giving me energy. 
all right yeah they realized they was under illusions yeah they realized they was under a cloudy judgment mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so that two of swords no more they're not they're not blind they're not blinded with this karmic right here they're not blinded that two of swords is in reverse mm -mm. Mm -mm. they realized they was only out for this money that's all this queen of pentacles wanted she's pulling energy out here and, and trying to cause confusions and illusions okay he or she take it how it resonates I feel like your person is doing this and you already done this. Uh, you already done this. Your person is just now getting on their path. Yeah, they are. They're just now getting from under this stalemate energy. They, they, they made a decision. They, yeah, this two of swords in reverse, they made a decision. Yeah, they did. Yeah, they did. They did. They realized that they don't have to sit out here under this. They made a decision and they let it go. Seriously, they let go of that karmic. That Ace of Wands energy, that magician energy ain't working on your person no more. Okay. Oh, wow. This is just so this karmic is the. Okay. All right. Let's go some more spirit. How long I've been on here already? Already 37 minutes. Oh, my goodness. This King of Pentacles, this King of Wands is in hermit energy. Didn't I tell you? I felt it. He's in this hermit energy. Or you, this your person took this leap of faith and this is hermit energy. I told you I felt that hermit. This person is now, work, this King of Wands bossed up. All right, he took leadership of his life. He's setting achievable goals right now, and for real, for real. All right, he took leadership of his life. He made a decision to move on and let go of that ten of wands. He let it go. No more. He's in this hermit energy. Okay, he's working on himself. Okay, yeah, this is a boss out here. All right, giving yourself credit for all the hard work. This is what he's doing right now. And this is what you're doing as well, too, my collective. And I feel like that's what they're seeing. This is the same energy from yesterday. So this karmic don't like it, but it's unstoppable. So I feel like this reading is just completely speaking for itself. Whatever this karmic is doing, whether it's your ex, and I also pick up on your person's ex. They finally waking up. They're no longer taking action. That sex magic ain't working with your person no more. No, it's not. No. No. They tired of being in that stalemate energy. They let it go. That's that two of swords in reverse. Yeah. They're no longer on these, under this illusion no more. That confusion no more. It's done. That karmic was left out in the cold. There it go. There it go. Your person took that leap of faith. That's them. That's them. And for the one that you left, they feel foolish for taking a leap of faith out here. Because now they're like a wounded warrior out here. And they out here don't know how to fucking move because they stuck. They can only watch you elevate in life. Because they stuck with their burdens out here. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. Oh, wow. So your king of wands, your twin, like I said, this, this person right here, they bossed up. They taking leadership of their life because I feel like you already doing it. You already on your destined path. Yes, this is true. This is a different time frame out here. You already healing. You on your destined path, Wheel of Fortune. Yeah, you already broke your cycles. Yeah, you sitting here pretty. You illuminated. You on your spiritual gift out here. You already doing this, my collective. You already took that leap of faith. You did. You already did this. That's you. 
Your future is looking bright. Everything's look, everything is looking good. But this two of cups right here, yeah, this is somebody from your past that's letting go of their situation too. Okay, yeah, because y'all are past life soulmates. Y'all are lovers, yeah. This King of Wands too, yeah, he's the one. He's the one that's feeling like a wounded warrior. This King of Wands right here. This is a, a, a fire sign. Yeah, he's in this hermit energy. He could have Virgo on his chart. This also go for this King of Wands out here who thought he had he was taking leadership of his life, thought he was bossing up out here, working on his situation. Yeah, thought he was going to go out here and learn new things. Nah, he ain't learned shit. He got a clouded judgment. This King of Wands is a whoever this King of Wands is to you. Okay? Yeah. This this King of Wands was like, like a lot of attention. Yeah, thought they had the other options out here. Well, they fucking stuck and feeling burdened right now. Yeah, they feeling like a wounded warrior out here for the ones for what I was speaking about in the beginning. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah. And for the other King of Wands out here, they're just getting on their path right here, letting go of this burden. Honey. They took that leap of faith and they're in their hermit energy, doing a lot of self-reflecting and healing right now. Because they're coming back right here to you. This is crazy. I'm just picking so much up on these energies. But for that fool who left you and liked this, all this attention, yeah, thought they had their other options out here, yeah. Fucking clouded judgment on their ass now. Look at them. Fucking wounded. Whatever they thought they was working on didn't work out for them. Nah. No, there it is. Didn't work out for them. Nope. 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 Because I really feel like heavily they was tapping into this spell work. They was they was either sitting here wishing ill intent on you. Doesn't have to necessarily be black magic. But some of them were just waiting for your downfall for you to come and chase them. Because this king of wands right here like attention. This one right here. This one. This reverse one right here. This this one. This this this. Yeah. That emperor. He's the one that's in the reverse right here. He's the one that's feeling like a wounded warrior now. Because whatever he, whatever options he thought he had and he chose, yeah, no. Now he's lacking in his own direction right now. Fucking stuck. He's left out in the cold with that karmic. Okay? All right now. Yeah. For the other king of wands out here, okay, he decided to take leadership of his life. He decided to set healthy boundaries out here because this right here is tested faith, resistant to release. It's also um, rest time for boundaries, needing to heal. And this King of Wands was realizing like, look, if I don't make a decision out here, cause I'm tired of being patient with you. I'm tired of being patient with you, Karmic. All right. I gotta let it go and they made that they they decide to do that they decide to do that they decide to let it go they was tired of feeling like this yeah they decide to let it go they took that leap of faith and they went into that hermit energy your person went into that hermit energy they working on their situations their own situations right now okay and they're just now getting on this path they are just starting this journey this portal really woke them up to see the truth. That confusion, that ace of wands, they was with someone who's lacking in their own direction, somebody who's very codependent, someone who don't know how to bring forth their own manifestations out here, okay? Somebody who had your person on the sex magic, illusions. Yes, they did. Your person. So now they right here, right here. I know it. I know it. I'm not crazy. This is what your person is doing right now. Yeah, they moved off. And that karmic is whatever she planted. It ain't going to work. It ain't going to work because it's all beautiful out here. It's it, it just let's get the healing energy on here. Let's get the protection energy on here. My collective. Let's get the energy on here. I just feel like heavily, mostly, 
it's their karma. It's, it's, it's this, this karmic is someone from your person's, your person who your person let go. Cause I feel like the person that you let go of, it could be them too trying to pull this magician work, but I really feel like it's, uh, I feel like my collective, I know, let me, let me just, oh my goodness. I just feel like, yeah, this relationship deserves a second chance. Didn't I tell you? This is someone from your past. That's the, that's their karmic trying to pull stunts. That's their karmic trying to pull stunts because they got left out in the cold. Yeah. Your person can't stop daydreaming about you. Didn't I tell you they was with them, but they can't stop daydreaming about you. Okay, wishful thinking. They want a second chance. Here it is. Oh. Uh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. It says this relationship deserve a second chance. And this karmic knows it. This karmic knows it. Oh boy, all right, what else is here? Yeah, here it is at the bottom of the deck. A new love or recommitment to love is developing. Here go the recommitment. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? If, if this is not saying what I'm, what I'm, what, come on now, second chance, new love, recommitment, or some of y'all are getting a new love because, like I said, they done fucked up out here. They just now realizing that that you are their soulmate, and they done fucked up. For the ones that I'm talking about here, this king of wands who love attention, thought he had all these other options, or she had the other, whoever this king of wands is to you, okay. That's a split energy on that King of Wands energy, okay? Yeah. This is this is a lot of split energy, but for some of them, they just now realize and then they want a second chance and they now realize in this relationship, they want, it, 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 they, they, they're gonna want a bag for a second chance in other words. But for the true King of Wands out here, the one that really bossed up, the one that decided no more, I'm letting go. I'm in my hermit energy right here healing. Yeah, getting on my path right here, making a final decision. I'm taking leadership of my life. I'm, I want real. I want to set achieve. I want somebody who sets achievable goals with me. Not only want me for my materialistic shit. You feel me? Cause this King of Wands is a boss. He's a he's a he's an entrepreneur. Yeah, he was the one that was holding the stability in the home, but he ain't doing that no more. Your person ain't doing that no more. And it's so funny because what I'm picking up on my collective, the person that this king, half of these king of wands out here, the one that 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 went out here and got this cloud of judgment, left you wounded, okay? They never believed in you that you would get right here and get stable. They never thought that you would be able to work on your situation and boss up on your own. They never thought that you would boss up on your own and do this on your own as a single parent, nah. They wasn't helping you to take care of them seeds out here, who they, the, the, the children. No, they wasn't. Ace of Wands in reverse. They wasn't giving you a dime. They left you and the kids out in the cold, right? Shock them that you did this, right? And you did it on your own. And for the and for your person, they were the, they are the boss. They are the entrepreneur. The person who they with can't do this. What you're doing. The person that they with can't be you, could never be. With or without anyone, you doing this on your own. So this Queen of Pentacles, she lost. She ain't getting no, yeah, she want this man money, but this man really got love for you. It's different energies out here. 
It's different energies for this Queen of Pentacles. This is just you overall. Single parent. Doesn't have to be a feminine energy, but you're a great single parent for some of y'all. You just stable out here. You loving yourself. You're much you're emotionally matured out here. You're you know what? You you out here. Some of y'all do this to bring y'all. Y'all do that. Y'all y'all give healing messages out here because that's what you're destined to do. That's what you do for work. Oops. I'm sorry, my collective. That's what you do for work. So there's nothing this person can do to you to stop you. Okay, this is what y'all doing on y'all own. That king of wands who thought he was out here, he made a clouded judgment out here now, and he's in a lack of direction of his own. He's fucking stagnant. Never thought you would be able to do this on your own. Never thought that you would get out of this un, um, codependent energy, on uh, emotional codependent on them. They never thought that you would do it on your kid on the own with your with your children or with your child. Never thought. Right? But it's opposite over here. It's opposite over here for your person. They're the one. They're the one that got this king of this queen of pentacles dependent on them. Yeah. Codependent on them. Because they do not know how to manifest their own change. That's who they let go of. Why? Because they got all this love for you. This is who they truly love. You. Right here. This king of pentacles. This king of wands. This is who he truly loves. Somebody who's independent. Somebody who's stable. Somebody who knows how to bring forth their own stability. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody who already on their own destined path. Okay? Somebody who, li who likes to work on their own situation and can work together with them as a team. Okay? He loves how you're putting in that work and watching you or she. They love how you're putting in that hard work. They love how you're ambitious. This karmic is the opposite. So, wow. Wow. That's just crazy. That's what I'm picking up on. Okay? This king of wands love you. This king of wands love you. I don't care if he got children with this queen of pentacles. Obviously, he does. So did you with your karmic, but you bossed up and you doing it on your own. And there, and this king of wands is watching you doing on your own. So he's like, wait a minute. If I've always been providing for you, you never provided for yourself. This is what he's telling the karmic. Then, and, 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 my, and my true love is over here doing it on her own or his own. Why the fuck you can't do it on your own? Fuck you. Six of Swords, stay right here in your fucking choppy waters on your own. I'm not doing that with you. No. I'm not doing that with you. I'm not doing that with you. I want real love. I'm tired of sitting under this confusion and illusions with you, wishful thinkings with you. Go to hell. I'm done. So he turned his back and let go of them burdens. Your person. There's these two energies out here. I got to talk about it. All right. So <laughs> let's, let's do it. Because Spirit is letting this karmic know. What's the, what's, the, what's, the, what's the warning for these karmic spirit? What's the warning for these karmics? Because I'm going to tell you right now. The one that didn't believe in you, left you hanging with the kids, or just left you hanging, you on your destined path, you heal. All right, you already doing you. You inspired this king of wands. Yes, you do. He took his leap of faith, or she took her leap of faith to leave their karmic and seeing them for who they are. They uh, they from under them cloud. No, no more. No more. They left them in, they left that karmic alone. They no longer working on that situation. No more. This emperor. Or this empress, whoever it is. Okay, they left a person. Yeah, because they're coming back to you. To where they're destined to be with. Who they're destined to be with. And that's you, my collective. Okay, because you're already on your destined path. You've already been illuminated. You're already out here waiting for your ships to come in. You're looking out in the four sites out here. You already took your leap of faith. You're already healed. You're on your spiritual path. This is, yeah, life purpose. This is what the star card means in Rider Tarot. All right, renewal, faith. You're on your life purpose right now. You're on your spiritual path. You're already doing this. 
You already brought forth your stability. You already already worked on your situations. Yeah. You're already giving yourself credit for all your hard work, your ambitions. You're being noticed for it as well. All right. You're being noticed for it. So you already did that. I feel like more like it. This is your person's karmic and your person. Their judgment is if they was out here thinking they was going to get better. Well, now they fucking stuck. Now they feeling like a wounded warrior. OK. All right. They know that a new love is coming for you. It says right here, a new love, a real commitment. I'm sorry, my collective. I don't know where I left off at, but let me just back it up a little bit. Okay. This arrogant, this arrogant one right here, who's under his cloud of judgment right now, this one right here, or she, take it how it resonates, who's feeling stuck. Yeah. Yeah. This is a six of swords and six of wands energy in reverse too, to me. Yeah. Their ego, their pride, everything. All right. They say the ego comes before, well, the, the ego comes before the fall, right? The pride comes before the fall. Very egotistical. They thought they was going to get better. They didn't believe in you. He or she didn't believe in you. No, they didn't. Now they fucking stress. Now they burdened, okay? They didn't thought that you were going to boss up over here. I know I sound repetitive, but I'm trying to make it clear because there's so many energies out here. I'm picking up from different angles. Damn. But spirit is like, their judgment, their karma is... Yeah, sit right there. Hold your judgment. Yeah, no justice will be served in your life because you was out here acting like an arrogant asshole. Now their burdens is on them. Now they feeling wounded, okay? Yeah, because when they turn their back on you, thought, thinking they was making better decisions for their future, their future ain't looking too bright. No, it ain't. Okay? So that's for the baby daddy, baby mama who didn't believe in you, okay? Yeah. Or ex-husband, ex-lover, whoever. Whatever they planning and plotting, they're going to be stuck right here in this situation. Their burdens will be returned onto them instantaneously. Bottom line. Justice will not be in their favor. Bottom line. Okay? That's one scenario. Okay? Yeah. Because that's you right here. This is you right here. This is all you. You, dest you. you got on your destined path. You stable right here. Single parent or not, you stable. Working parent or not, you stable. You got all these, you out here looking in the foresight out now. All right. Yes, you are. You following your intuition now. You on your path. You took that leap of faith. You and the babies, y'all are happy. Very happy. Happiness, stable. Just abundance. Okay. You on your spiritual path. Okay. You're living in your life purpose. That's you. Okay. That's you, my collective. All right. And this fool right here. This King of Wands, King of whoever this King of Wands is, I don't give a fuck who it is. It's that fire sign. Yeah. You bossed up. You took leadership of your life. You did it all. You're right here already. They thought they was going to get it. No, they didn't. For the other scenario, for the other scenario, this very same King of Wands, there's two energies on this King of Wands. I ain't crazy, my collective. Just bear with me, please. I know these videos are long, but just bear with me. This King of Wands was dealing with a karmic. This king, yeah, she did. She had him under these illusions right here. Had him under these clouds of judgment, but he turned his back. He finally made a decision. He's tired of feeling like a wounded warrior. And he let go of them burdens. He ain't playing no more. He left her out in the cold. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. He took leadership of his life. Yes, he did. Okay? Yes, he did. Why? Because he did the same thing you did. Took that leap of faith. Fool card. He's right here now. He's just, or she is just now getting on this. They're just now going within and doing this self-reflecting and healing and putting up their boundaries now to this karmic who they left out in the cold. Okay, they're just now doing that. Because why? You and them are destined to be. They're watching you over here, their real true star. Okay, they've been illuminated to who they really love. They got from under those illusions. Okay, yes, yes. They're now on their destined path like you. This is your, yes. Why? Because they're in this nostalgic, look at that, six of cups, two of cups, yes, yes. They got all this love for you, my collective, okay? Mature person, nurturing, you know, uh, someone who's in flow, someone who controls their, you know, who have their emotions in check. Yeah, you just mature, very compassionate. That's who they love. This is who they love. This is what they want, second chance. This relationship deserves a second chance because who they were with had them on the cloud of judgment. That was just a karmic soulmate. 
That's how I pick it up. I don't care if they got kids with this Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. However, I don't care if they have children with them. They decide to let go of that Queen of Pentacles energy. They decided to let it go because this is where they're at. Why? A new love or recommitment to love is developing. But this King of Wands is now healing himself. This entrepreneur boss, this king right here, this queen right here, whoever it is, is coming back to you. They took that leap of faith, but they just now taking it. Okay, now, and for some, you just got a new love coming for you, baby. It, it just is. It is what it is. New love is coming for you. Okay. So let's just get the outcome because I'm not worried about the karmics, but let's just get the outcome on what is their plan because I just feel like you guys are unstoppable. Y'all on y'all destined path out here. Spirit is right here guiding y'all to the fullest. Okay. The angels all around y'all in this union and the new love that is to come for you. They can't stop that. Whether it's a new love, a recommitment, or the second chance that you're going to get with your person. Okay. It is what it is. All right. It is what it is. What's the scoop on this karmic spirit? A new line of study researching occult things. That's what they're trying to do. That's what they're trying to study. Yeah. Some of them are out here going in the dark. The spirit is like, whatever they're going to do, that ten of swords, they're not going to be able to manifest their changes out here. No, they're not. They won't ever, they won't, whatever they're trying to study. I told you in the beginning of this reading, they're, whatever they're summonsing in the dark, whatever they're summonsing in the dark, okay, it's going to be attached to them. Whatever they're plotting and planning and studying out here, it's going to be a fucking clouded judgment on them. All right, now. They need to go within, take the time to do some self-reflecting and healing on their own. They're codependent. Told you. Look at that. Black magic. Someone has been doing black magic. This is what they're trying to do. But Spirit is warning them, you need to go within, Carmen. Yeah, you've been left out in the cold, but everybody, you can always, everybody can have their new beginnings. Somebody, everybody been at this point at some point in their life. You ain't the only one. Stop acting like a motherfucking victim. Okay? Go into your past. Go heal your childhood wounds. That's what you need to do, Carmen. Cut it out. You can't do anything to our fire signs. You need to go within yourself, do some self-reflecting and take time to heal because she's pissed or they're pissed because, and I feel like this is your person's karmic. They're fucking upset because this King of Wands is now taking leadership of his life and he's in this hermit energy. Yeah, he's doing some self-reflecting. You need to go and do the same thing too. Like I said, you're not the only person that's been like this, been at this point in their life, left out in the cold. Everybody got to get to this point to figure out a new beginning. We all been there. Get your ass up and stop acting like a fucking knock. All right now. Get your ass up. Because th this, this, this union over here is destined to be. Leave it alone. This is more of a lover's energy out here. Cut the black magic. Because whatever you are summonsing in the dark, you will not be able to manifest the changes. You will not manifest any change. Justice, you will not get the justice in your favor. This is karma. That's karma. You will be left out in the cold and continue to be left out in the cold. Cut it out. You will be suffering. Cut it out. Go start your own new beginnings now. Stop it. Stop trying to cause this confusion. Karmic. Stop it. So whatever you out here studying, new lines of research of occult stuff, cut it out. Stop it. Cut it out. Go heal. That six of swords is in reverse. Go and heal. You're a stalemate. Go make your own decisions. This person, you, my, my collective, don't, my collective's better half do not owe you anything. My collective's better half do not owe you anything. Stop the black magic. Stop studying new shit. It ain't gonna work. 
So this is what they're doing. This is what they're plotting and planning for this portal. That's what they're doing. But I told you that 10 is in reverse. Yeah. They're going to wish. They ain't never take this leap of faith because they out here fucking acting reckless. Still acting a fool. Still acting a fool. But see, I told you, Spirit said they're going to be bound to this situation. This karma, it says feeling bound to a current situation. Yeah. Because they can't stop what's destined to be. They cannot stop what is destined to be. Whether you have a somebody coming back to you or you just simply just sitting here beautiful and abundant on your spiritual path. You're on your life purpose, baby. They can't stop what God has made you to be. They need to go within and do this self-reflecting and heal. But they refuse to, honey. Mm-mm. Mm -mm, they refuse to. And Spirit is letting them know they're going to be bound to this situation. Yeah. You look at them. They, they're trying to say someone is sending, is wishing ill intent. Didn't I tell you? That's what they're doing. Wrong way. Why? Because your person, and I'm really strongly picking up on this because my collective, you good. This is your person's reading coming through on this portal. This is a love twin flame soulmate reading coming through for this portal. Take it how it resonates. Okay? Your person realized and you realized. You already been realized. All right? Wrong way. The direction that you were moving in, were moving in, was the wrong way. Make a U-turn. Your person is just now getting on this path. You already made the U-turn. They're just now getting in this journey. New view. Seeing things from a higher perspective. Thank you. Thank you. Submerged emotions. Someone's feelings running. Uh, someone's feelings run really deep, but they are concealed. Yeah, because they're dealing with all this bullshit over here. Once again, they probably still got this baby, this this ex lover who they letting go of. That's still trying to come at them. Still trying to. Yeah, but they were right here the whole time with that person submerged in their emotions. For you, where's that six of cups? They stayed in a nostalgic energy over you. Here it is. They had to hide how they were truly feeling. Because this emperor, your person or the empress, take it how it resonates. This person was trying to keep it together for the family. They had a family with that queen of pentacles. They was trying to keep it together, but the whole time they was right here. All they could do is daydream about you. Why? Because they were dealing with this copycat, childish bra. Look at that. They were dealing with a copycat. That's who's pissed off. But they need to stop. Look at that. Someone is being childish. Someone is mimicking everything you do. Didn't I tell you? Wow. I know I ain't crazy, my collective. So when I do go on and on, spirit let telling me I need to go on. They can never be you, queen of pentacles. Someone who's independent, baby. Someone who's achieved all your material wealth. You're achieving, you're achieving your goals out here, baby. Stop it. Okay? You stable out here, boo. Anybody would want to put a ring on your finger. Really? They was a false. They was a copycat. They had your person under illusions, like I said earlier. Yes, they were. They had your person under sex magic. Yes, they did. Yes, they did. They was using that black magic on your person. Yes, they were. To get them to marry them. Okay? Yeah. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. Now they trying to send an evil eye, trying to wish ill intent on your person and you. Cause they out here childish. And, and trust me, if they doing all of this, they getting they getting tower readings on the whole nine, this childish baby mama, ex-lover that your person left. They getting all of this. Cause she was a he or she was a copycat. They can never be this on their own. Never. All right. Spirit said they're gonna be bound to this. They need to go within, take the time to do some self-reflecting or else, or else they need to go within, stop all this black magic, stop sending evil intent because that's what they're going to be stuck with. Like I said, in the very beginning, that's what they're going to be stuck with. They're going to be unable to not uh, able to manifest any changes in their life. They're going to stay in the six of swords in reverse. They out here still trying to study shit. They going down the wrong path. They need to start seeing things from a new perspective, a higher perspective, but no. No. They feed off of your person's energy. Yes, they do. They don't know how to think for themselves. 
Does this look like somebody who knew how to start their own beginnings? No. All this person had your person under was a sex, that magic, ace of wands. And it ain't working no more because this king of wands is no longer being touched. He ain't physically fucking with her no more. Or he or you ain't physically fucking with them no more. Your person, he or she ain't fucking with this person no more. Uh, you, my collective, you good. That's I'm just I'm just picking up on your person through this portal reading. I'm telling you the truth. That's that's the truth. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Breaking point. Things are becoming too much to bear. Yeah. Yeah. There it is. That's what that King of Wands realized. Things was just becoming too much to bear. I'm letting go. I need to heal. Fuck that. I'm tired of being wounded with your ass. I'm tired of being patient with you. I have to finally make up my mind to remove myself from you. I can't. Done. That's what your person is doing. Why? Because right now they're right here. Manifest. Your desires are within reach. This King of Wands know that, baby. He know he bought. He a boss. He or she know they a boss. Access have been denied. They blocking that. So anything that this karmic is trying to do, it's blocked. Spirit is blocking it. It has been denied. Why? Because you and your person is leveling up. Okay? You are a leveling, leveling up in life. And that's the truth. It's all, okay? Yeah. Performer, entertainment industry. Some of y'all are probably in this entertainment industry. Or this karmic is just a good performer. They, they deserve a Grammy, okay? For the way they speak. Like, they got their shit together. They thought they had their shit together. But it didn't work out. Didn't I tell you for that king of wands who thought he was the shit? Huh? The one that thought he was the shit or she. Take it how it resonates. All right, now. They know they can no longer communicate or talk to you. They know they've been blocked, okay? Yeah, some of them went out here thinking they was going to get that contract. They thought they was going to be the next biggest thing. Uh-huh. They thought they was going to be the next biggest star out here, huh? I guess not. It was all a fucking dream. It was all a dream, okay? Yeah. And this karmic right here, she's a great performer. This bitch needs, she's a great actress, real drama queen or drama king, whoever it is. All right. And that's who your person is leaving alone. Why? Because they have romantic thoughts about you, boo. Yes, they do. What's that romantic thoughts? Them six of cups, that two of cups, that daydreaming. That's all they were doing the whole time when they was there. Okay. Uh, addictions, because they were dealing with this obsessive codependent narc. Yeah. Narc. Ooh. What else going on with this karmic spirit? Overall, it's beautiful for y'all. Yeah, it's beautiful for y'all. There it is. There it is. This phase will soon end. So whatever this, your karmic, whoever it is, yeah. I, 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 like I said, I'm strongly picking up on your person's karmic. They're the one that's pulling these stunts out here. That phase will soon end. There it is. That's their judgment. That's justice not being served in their favor. That's karma. Okay? Yeah. Stay manifesting, boo. Your desires are within reach. Okay? Your person is on their destined path. You already on your destined path, my collective. All right? Large cash flow is coming in for both of y'all, boo-boo. Keep doing that. That desire is right here. Large cash flow. Cash flow is coming in. And another thing is this Queen of Pentacles, who your person married, who he's leaving because she this copycat broad mm -hmm, who wanted to be the Queen of Pentacles. That's the only way she got your person to marry them. Uh-huh. The one who's really childish. Okay. Spirit is letting her know that says that phase, that phase will be ending soon. Okay. You will be blocked and delete from the spiritual realm as well. Because you ain't taking the tower moments. I'm pretty sure they're getting the warnings. Here go the burdens right here. Here go the burdens right here. Okay, now. They're they getting them warning signs to stop going down the wrong way. But they're not listening. No, 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 no. They don't want to see things from a higher perspective. No. They don't want to see things from a higher perspective. And because your person is doing it now, it's a fucking problem. Okay, because your person is going within and taking the time to reflect and heal. Spirit is wanting them to do the same thing too and let it go let it go but this karmic refuse and spirit is warning them whatever altercations they are trying to create they're going to be bound to that shit because that's this phase is about to be ended your you your access have been denied okay it has been denied copycat you are not the original earth angel cut it out you are not this person's true love cut it out okay someone is um someone is desiring you yeah that's that that's your person my collective 
They always been desiring you. And whatever altercations, a physical altercation may break out. Yeah, that physical altercation may end up getting this karmic in jail. Okay? Justice is not going to be in their service, uh, in, their, in, their, in their favor out here. Okay? All right now, because your person let go. Your person has got rid of those three of swords out of their heart. No more. They let it go. So whatever they're trying to create, they will be blocked. They will be blocked. And when y'all come together, this is what it's going to be, baby. This is what it's going to be. And she know. They know. They know. So keep manifesting, boo. Stay right here in that new view. Because whatever altercations they're coming with, access has been denied. They're being warned that they're going down the wrong path. They're being warned that they're going to be bound to their situation. I told you this earlier. They're going to be bound to whatever they're plotting and planning. Okay? Because that phase is going to end. This, this, this lion portal ain't no joke. So whatever they doing, whatever they studying out here, because they can't take it, they, they fucking obsessive out here. Addictions. If they getting high and thinking negative or whatever the fuck it is they're obsessed with, and I feel like that's both of y'all. My collective, your person's person is obsessed with both of y'all. They fucking obsessed and addicted to some pills, drugs, alcohol, drinking, whatever it is too as well. Sex, whatever it is. But see, they can't have your person under these addictions no more. They can't have your person acting obsessive, obsessive over them anymore because they, they were doing it under spells. That's what it was. So if your person was tripping on you before in the past, acting a fool, huh? It's because they was under this. This black magic, that sex magic. Yeah, it was. Yeah. But not no more. Not no more. And Spirit is warning them, stop, stop it. Stop going out here to figure out shit and going deeper. Stop it. You will be bound because that situation is about to be ended. And you are going down the wrong way now. Any altercations that you're trying to break out out here will be breaked out on you. It will be put back on you. It will be a, 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 a burden onto you that you're going to be needing to ask for help by the time your judgment reach you, karmic. You're going to be asking for help by the time your karma hits you. Stop it. You're being blocked. Allow your person, allow the person to grow. Leave them alone. Go do some self-reflecting and heal. Stop being a copy. You will never be this. You were never meant to be this. So whatever they plan in my collective, they've been blocked. Access denied. Y'all are safe. Y'all are destined to be. Okay? Yeah. There's no, there's no, there's no, there's no doubt about that. All right. This is definitely healing. This is all love. Okay, and Spirit is saying right here, the message of Oracle Love, a second chance. This relationship deserves a second chance. Romantic thoughts. Okay, two of cups, six of cups. Okay, yeah. Look at all this healing and all this love. Your first, you already hear my collective, but your person is just now getting into this and doing this self-reflecting and healing. They just now walked away from the situation and putting up their boundaries, okay? Your person is just doing this. But eventually it is, it is what it is. 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 And this karma can't do a damn thing. It's going to be a cash flow out here. She's trying to get this King of Wands to hit every dime. That's what she's trying to do. That's what she wants because she know he, he's a boss. King of Wands is somebody who's stable. He's an entrepreneur. Got that material well. Very materialistic, but he got that money. He's stable. Okay, that emperor came out here. Yeah. But he decided I'm going to be a, a great father or a great mother outside of the home because I can't deal with your shit no more. I, I'm tired of feeling hurt. I need to heal. I'm done. And that's what he's doing. She or he needs to do that too because they're going to be bound to their situation. Look at them trying to pull this black magic, studying new things. Look at them. Spirit is like, let, let it go. You're going down the wrong path, boo. Let it go. Go within and go heal. Cut it out. Go start your own new beginnings. Cut it out. Stop it. Let go of those addictions. Go get a therapist. Do something. Stop sitting here wishing ill intent. Stop it. Stop trying to cause burdens and demise because it's going to be on you. It's going to be on you. All right. That's what I have for you, my fire signs. All right. Yeah. That's what I have for you, my collective. If you enjoyed this read, please like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification button. Yeah. I wish you guys love and light. Definitely wish you guys love and light. Yeah. says it right here, Carmen. Let me give you one more message. Forgiving yourself 
or another will help you to move forward. Go do some self-reflecting. This is day warning once again. Once again. Love and light, my beautiful soul subscribers.